Welcome back. Emmy-winning actor and Stephans Jones has died at age 66. A representative for this is Us Alam confirmed the news to people, stating, Beloved and award-winning actor Ron Cephas Jones has passed away at the age of 66 due to a long-standing pulmonary issue throughout the course of his career. His warmth, beauty, generosity, kindness, and heart were felt by anyone who had the good fortune of knowing him. He began his career at the Neurorican Poets Cafe and his love for the stage was present throughout his entire career, including his recent Tony-nominated and Drama Desk award-winning performance for his role in Clyde's on Broadway. The statement continued, Ron's inner beauty and soul was evident to the huge audience from his multi-Emmy award-winning performance on This Is Us. He is survived by his daughter, Jasmine Cephas Jones. Jones began his acting career in 1994 after landing a part in the movie Modern Magic. He's appeared in a number of films since then, including Across the Universe, Dog Days, and an uncredited role in Venom. He began his TV takeover in 1996 with roles in Law and Order and New York Undercover. Other roles included Luke Cage and, most recently, Truth Be Told and the Law and Order spin-off, Law and Order Organized Crime. Perhaps his most notable role is as William Hill on NBC's heart-wrenching drama This Is Us. The actor first appeared in season one, being introduced to the biological father of Stellan K. Brown's Randall Person. He went on to record in a total of he went on to record in a total of forty three episodes up until the series ended last year. The role won him two Emmys and a SAG award, among other nominations. He always brought a lot of emotion to the role. Not to mention, seeing Randall interact with his biological father was always a nice sight, even if it did bring some tension to the persons at times. Ren Cephas Jones did have one series in production, Genius, MLKX, but it's unknown how far the series was into production before its pause because of the WGA and sad after strikes. While fans may be able to rewatch much of his filmography thanks to streaming, it's going to be hard without him, but it will be like he's still here, even though he isn't. Hollywood is in mourning once again and it's breaking. Hollywood is in mourning once again and our condolences go out to Joan's family and loved ones. Thanks for listening.